two humans lie in lie in a twisted pile. Ah! They were trying to say something to hu the humans barricaded on the other side of the wall, but they received only bullets as a reply. The death of a parents became a signal. The birds surrounding the little house crossed the wall as one. I can hear gunfire from inside. I can hear gun I can hear humans and birds screaming. We could we could do nothing but stand outside and watch. But then the stranger came in and came and spoke to us. Is there anything you desire? We will grant any wish for you. So tell me. I answered. I don't want these things to happen anymore. We wish for a world where humans and birds no longer fight. Even if I die, I want there to be peace. And Venice continued, I agree. And I would do anything to make Rio's wish come true. The stranger nodded. It might not be possible right now, but one day I will make that make it happen. Wow. We were children. That's right. That was you. That was the other thing you have forgotten. You have remembered, I see. Wow. Eight years ago, a number of humans barricaded themselves in a building not far from where we lived. Venice's parents were shot by the other humans, and many birds and humans were killed in the air ensuring gunfight. And I met the doctor. I asked for a world which humans and birds no longer fight. You and Miss Venice both said that you were glad to die to bring it about. And I am carrying, carrying out your wish, just as you have stated. Even symbiotic relationships are not free from strife. In order to end the wars between humans and birds forever, one race would have to be completely destroyed, you see. Why did you choose me back then? Choose you? Why did I ask you, ask what, yes, what you wish for you? I am sure it was not a coincidence. I was not so bored bored as to wonder about granting wishes willy-nilly. I too had made a promise. To grant your wish. I primarily test yeah pri test was yesterday was a resounding success. We needed only transfer the original Isolomus from Fujira Nagaki to you, and everything would be in place. I granted your wish. Though I did, not, I did make you jump through a few hoops so you would remember to make sh remember your wish and understand my intentions. It would be at least it would be the least you could do if to at least uh, do at least acknowledge all that I've done for you. Mm -hmm. I don't care about anything right now. Venice is gone. My wish has destroyed everything. Nothing good has ever come happened. If there's, if this is what my life is to be like, I wish I'd never been born. I don't want to see see anything anymore. Don't be anxious. You'll have no, you, you'll have no will to resist as soon as you will forget it all. Good night, Mr. Nana Kawara. Ah, my crimson breast senses death. Ugh. Talking will only make it worse, Higora. Hmm, it seems seems to be le leaking in quite slowly. I am glad we have a little more time, but this is getting hard to breathe. Wellenstein, you're you coward! Come out and fight! <laughs> cow, cow! Hold, hold on, just a little longer. We will get you out of there. We will try to open the cage. Oko, you see to the gas. Oh, of course, aren't you not fair? Rescue. Ah, much better. No one's, no one can say you slack off as a student pres, a student president, Shirogane. The Crimson Breast shall not forget this. You are you two alone? Where did Kawara go? Coco, where is that pretty real? Wonder I'm getting lost. No, he didn't. He got carried off by the doctor. Carried off. Uh, carried off? 
No, I thought so I was making him drink nasty protein supplements. That's what he's like. Oh. Uh, if you do not act soon, the funeral song shall shall hear out the coming of the darkness. Why can you never speak in plain Japanese, miserable platoon? Platoon. He's saying that the doctor's planning to turn Kawara into a biological weapon. What? We can explain while we walk. Assuming I don't run out of breath. Very well, let us proceed. Kuwar, are you still alive? Whoa! What the hell? Koo! Okusan has a bad feeling about this world is not normal! Miserable medical man, what have you done to him? Why, isn't the son of the noble the Bell family? What is one of your prestige doing here? You pathetic jabs mean nothing to me. What do you have done to Kuara? I have granted his wish. That is all. It is almost ten. The human forces are gathered above. Mr. Kuara will now return to the service and begin to end the human race. Kuara would wish for no such thing. He would never bring harm to human. Right, Kuara? Jesus Christ. It seems he is hesitant to agree with you, huh? Uh huh. -huh. Ugh. He has been swallowed by the demon spores. Our voices will not reach him. It is time for us to go. He has but little time left in this world and cannot afford to waste any of it. He, he has but little time. What does this mean? His duty now is to fly. Fly about the world, spreading the seeds of throughout throughout the all of humanity. It will it will be a feat impossible for any normal rock dove. But of course he will he'll be a shot he'll be shot at shot at as well. If he, he were to fall from his wounds, he he would die before completing his task. Go! Do not fear, because I will stop around over here right now. Uh, go! There he goes. Mister Kawara has trained his free will for normal, impossible physical tendency. He's been, he's been brainwashed. We have to stop him and bring him back to his senses before he reaches the surface. But Oko, so, Oko is stronger than any of us. If he set, if he was sent flying just like that, how can we keep him here? Hmm. Kuara is very strong, but lacks control right now, right? Maybe we should ask Hagora. What? Him? He's nuts. That's the wrong voice. He's nuts. Uh, uh, black, black demonic. There he goes again, spouting gibberish. Wait, Kuwar, stop! Uh. Oh dear, there goes Shiragani. The demon, the demon red eye speaks. Seal the disaster. Yeah, uh, why? Yeah, I know. This is going on a lot longer than I thought it would. Kinda hard to hurry up when this thing isn't over. Seal the disaster of the rose of that. Uh, something happened. He's wrecking. How is the player design able to infect him? Well, he's just gods. What is he doing? Hip, 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 uh, hypnotizing him. According to the documents back here, Gore has the ability to pull others into his own fantasies and break them down into mental restraints. He was, he was talking to the doctor about it earlier too. I think he's real. Mental restraints. Like how a desperate man can be stronger than usual. Demon Red Eye Harlan's of the Awakening. By the power of the bloodstained hand, I seal the funeral song. Oh gosh, I'm attack! Oh gosh, I'm gonna have possibly losing that fight without. There we go, perfect. We're 
We're supposed to con uh, we're supposed to convince Ryota to stop while our while ourselves being drawn into some bizarre fantasy. This is madness. Don't think about the consequences at all, Jirogane. Just go along with it. Prepare yourselves. We fight. Barret bound with the red loose fur. Ferds. A boss fight. Oh, they cut off his tail. That's kind of stupid. Uh, save. <laughs> Ryota, Angel's turn. Oh, that's cool. Black Demon by Silent. <laughs> oh, cross on that. Yeah, Koo or Koo Koo. Let's go for Koo Koo. <laughs> How far are we on? It's not a good we are not. Come to your senses. <laughs> Uh, is, is there really a difference? Listen to us. We're all trying our best for you, Kawara. Come back to us. <laughs> uh, listen to me. Do you not care? Do you plan to destroy all we've gained? Stop, Kawara. This is not the path you must travel. Jeez, Ryota, you're causing everybody trouble. I don't want you to see. I don't want to see you like this either. I'm the only Berserk class character this story needs. <laughs> Wake up already, Ryota. Ryota was defeated. Wow. <laughs> that was an epic comeback. <laughs> Ugh. Kawara, pull yourself together. Do you want this? No. I don't. Ryota has visualized it. He should answer himself. I don't want to make anyone sad. The remainder react reacted. Fascinating. It should not have been possible for some hours yet. Disease is half, half in the mind, after all. Outlook is surprisingly important. <laughs> I suppose that means my data was insufficient. This is the end, Dark Source, as well as he. By judge of the. Uh, by judge by the Crimson Beast. Rest. Wait, Angel. It's not just his fault. Why do you. Why do you protect him? It is the one who did this to you. Tell me, Doctor. Why? Why did you go so far to grant my wish? Why did I go grant your wish? My reason for no nothing of known. This is. Not worth telling. This was merely an experiment. It has, it has now come to an end. You, you must have had a reason. You aren't some. You aren't the sort to go around take, talking to children without some purpose. I want to know the answer to everything. The answer is nowhere near as glamorous as you were expecting. I assure you. Oh God, more story. Four hours. Uh. Hey, good morning, Isa. Sorry, sorry to spring this on you, but could you take a look at this? What is it, sir? It seems exciting. It's amazing, the healers we got earlier. Healers? Ah, uh, the hella. The hella cells from last month. Yeah, them. Um, from the unusual old human. Aiding science even after death? We can't, we can't at, can't at least call the samples by their proper name? I've always been serious about that, Is Isa. These samples are like sweet lovebirds. Touch them with kindness, and they'll, res and they'll respond beautifully. Just how many lovebirds do you have again? Perhaps you should call them your pet birds instead. <sighs> Maybe you're right. Anyway, look at this. We've been looking, looking into cancer cell immortality. This, indeed, these results are amazing. You're quite lucky with these things. It's about, it's all about love or intuition. That too. Kawara. Uh. 
Oh, wait a minute. Wait. Ryoji. Uh, he's, he's quite possibly the most gifted researcher alive. He has abilities and intuition that can never be explained. I mean, never can be explained. Hey, good morning, Isa. Nice weather, huh? Makes me want to do something outside. It's already evening. I believe one normally switches to good evening around here. It's good morning whenever I get up, Isa. Get distracted by things like the common sense, you'll miss the great discoveries of your life. <laughs> hey, good morning, Isa. Whoopsie, we're low on cash. Here. Here, was this one? I didn't ask you to pick it up for me. Here, take it. It's not like we're running out. You sound like a pushy salesman. Your right wing is injured, right? Is there anything I can help you with? Just ask. I've been doing just fine. Good morning, guys. <laughs> hey, can I ask to say something? What is it, sir? I am somewhat busy. You're always busy. If you want... If I wait for you to take a break, I die in an old age before I got to say. Talking like this gets us nowhere. Guess what? I had a kid. Hmm. See, congratulations. What? You don't have anything else to say? Not particularly. Reproduction is natural for all living creatures. Of course, were I, were, were I to become a father, I could feel bad for the child given, given my habit of locking myself away in the laboratory. The only bird who I ever recognized, the only one I ever recognized as worthy of my respect. Hey, good morning, Isa. I brought you something cool. Hmm? What is it? A fossil. Look at it. It's huge. You act like a exotic child. Hey, I like geology too. <laughs> it tempt me, tempts me with a spouse, spouse branch. I'll carry on your research while while you're out. Out there then. Go on. Dang, you're cold. Hey, listen, wanna come with me on a, on a business trip to some time? Field observe observation observation. It's fun. Next one on the start is Monday. <laughs> well, I am interested in your work, sir. I am part way through the fascinating process at the moment. Perhaps another time. Yeah, I'll invite you next time then. I bet traveling with you would be a blast. Field observation is not exactly sightseeing. I will make sure to open, open time in my schedule, though. His last moments were dreadfully anticlimactic. He fell ill with a disease endemic to the island. By the time we he, we returned, he was em emaciated. One could barely recognize him. He had watched as many other birds succumb to disease, so I was sure, so that he would die in this examination room surrounded by his family. Isa, I always knew this was a possibility. Yes, sir. I don't regret the way, way I did things. No, sir. But I just remembered. I do have one regret. Yes, sir. I never... I never done anything a father's supposed to do. I promise to take time off for the first time in years. I want you to do me a favor, Isa. If you ever run into my son, can you do something for him in my stead? A rather vague request. It's too nice. He never, he never asked for something, even if he wanted it. I suspect he inherited that trait from his father. <laughs> anyway, if anything were, if you were ever happen to meet him. You don't have to go out of your way, way to find him or anything. Very well. I shall remember. What is his name? Ryota. It's Kawara. Ryota. You vanished from my life before I even told you my feelings. And I've chased, you, chased your shadow since then. Is that what they mean by quitting while you're ahead? Or was it just cowards? Ugh. No matter how I study life, its past, its future, I will never be able to surpass you. That was my only goal. Kuara Ryota, the son of the Dr. Kuara, carrying half of the genetic material and otherwise unrelated, but this boy. 
It may be the only way, way for me to catch your shadow now. Oh my god, don't say there's more! God! I can't take any more! When your father died, my world was altered. One might say that his influence o over me grew after death, both for good and for ill. Kuara Ryoji. All I did, all I, all I can recall of now is the voice and the color of his wings. He rarely returned home, always leaving mother and me behind, alone. You did this to carry out my father's will? You misunderstand. This was not just a parting kindness between colleagues. Colleagues, I doubt that there, that anyone in the world is with a stronger sense of duty than I. Then it was my final challenge to me, and you see the result. But your refusal is hardly rational. I was only trying to grant your wish, and I had had you but accepted it. It would have been so. Are you dissatisfied with something? A world without strife, where no one will have a loved one stolen from them. That is the world I wish for. I never asked for the world where human race is killed. A pity, a pity that you did not say so eight years ago. What, what abuse contract was this? This is no power in prayer. I should have never met you. Doctor, my wish ends today. Father is no longer in this world. It is no reason to you to chase after him, chase after his final will anymore. <laughs> Do you mean you're sympathizing with me? Oh, how high I have fallen. I can feel his pit pitying gaze even now. Very well, the contract ends today. And I must admit defeat. It is not over yet. We must open the gates of Tartarus into the depths of the abyss. We are only about ten minutes until the human race come into from above. I see you are still alive, gentlemen. Mr. Leon. Oh, man. I bring with one, bring me with all those who refuge in the gym. Wow, it's like something out of a sci-fi fiction movie. I bet it's filled by Mibs. Bad! Well, I guess nobody's panicking anyway. Miss, Mr. Shiragane, I will recover Sakio's body before I leave. Have no fear. I am grateful. I, I am grateful to you. The exit is no doubt activated by final signals of the researchers who worked here. Correct. Do not fear, I shall lead you to it. God! The doctor is so weird. He follows order and law. The doctor's even creepier when he's being cooperative. Do, do not base my actions on foolish pride or emotion. I carried out an experiment and I have obtained the result. I have nothing more to gain or lose here. Is... Uh, is that everyone? Thank God. Shall we go, Coral? Can you stand? Uh, yeah. But... We... We need to bring Yuki with us. I think everyone else has gone outside. Doctor, I shall not forget what has taken place here. Once we are outside, I shall see that you face judgment. Your words are hotly and immature, as always. Do as you please, if you can. I will indeed. Remember my face, villain. Well, who knows? I find you uninteresting, so I may well forget. I must think carefully about my plans once I'm outside. I still have much research to... <laughs> Did he get shot? Doctor? A, gun sh a gunshot echoes through the room. The doctor collapses. Madness! Is there, time Is there still time before the humans?
Wait, did you shoot him? Mr. Nanaki? A pistol's in his hand. He wobbles over the doctor with the same unsteady, careless gant. Gant, as always, and... <clears throat> this is the end of your research. Holy shit. Nanaki, what? Stop! The doctor shouldn't have... Had the... Have a fair trial once we... A fair trial, hmm. What do you think, Doctor? Uh, well, I am impressed at your acuity in attacking my uninjured left side. But of course, thank you. Tell me, Doctor, you, uh, no, Isa. I need to bring him back with me. That's why I've done all this. Tell me, where is Nageki? Nanaki points the points the gun at the mobile doctor. Man, I'm just trying to imagine the scene here, just holding a pistol. <laughs> oh God. He looks quite prepared to shoot the patient par dead at the moment, any moment. Oh, is that it? Uh, I have quite forgotten. Mr. Fushiro's brother. He was a quell.